I feel like this is when um, disaster hits while we're down here, I guess. Oh, and can this back. I can't believe you had to take a detour to Route 3 to get here. We just went through the tunnels this morning and everything seemed fine. Not too surprised. The tunnels look kind of dangerous. More safety precautions must be placed if we truly want trainers to pass through. Yeah. Something the matter, Kenneth? Just a little on edge right now. Between that letter and that person I saw. The person you saw? The redhead bitch. Uh, we're, we were in Gearin. I saw someone that... Well, it doesn't matter. Oh, is he talking about Deegan? Mm. What does matter is that Tesla is going to kill me once she finds out I went to Gearin City without meeting up with her. Oh. <laughs> well, honestly, it's probably a good idea because, uh... She married your brother, of all things, if you believe it. They don't, they don't let her find out. I can't have a dead trainer, can I? It's not. I'm just, I just really wanted to focus on sending that letter out to Mama. Need to make sure she's safe. Can't take any chances. Oh, she might be gone. What do you think of that threat, anyway? I like to think it's an empty threat, but we cannot be reckless. The moment we underestimate the sender, we may be in an inescapable pit of despair. I agree, we can't let our guard down. But this is already strange, isn't it? Talia and Nora are usually relaxing in the living room at this time. It is very strange indeed. You want me to scan the area for the aura? Please do, as you wish. Yeah, Talia is in Amethyst Caves. Nora, she's probably with Sella. Uh, what did you find them? I didn't find Tala, Talia, but Nora is in Sella's house. Sella's house. But there's someone outside the house, on the left side. The person's a male and he's leaning against the wall, drinking something? Excuse me? What the? I'm gonna go check this out. Kiron? Deacon? Can't be. And it's fucking Deacon. Oh, well, well. If it isn't my favorite person, me, Hermano, my little brother, I hope I pronounced that right. Deacon? Uh, oh, he is drunk, at, drunk as shit. Now you, rem now you remember me. I'm flattered. Really, I am. Have you been drinking? What the hell are you doing here? A little depressed, that's all. But it's like the person who ran away from his family would care. I didn't run away, Deacon, and you know that. You can call it what you want, little bro, but I know, know the truth. You wanted to become just like Dad, and you sure did get what you want. Both of you ran away because you couldn't be asked to keep up with your family. Excuse me? You went to go help people, and this family is proud of that. And right now, you're just being a dick. Dad died on a rescue mission. He didn't leave because he wanted to. So now you know everything, then. Why haven't you been keeping in contact with Mama? I've been busy. Uh, cut the bullshit, Kenneth. You know it takes no time to send a letter. Just like the one you sent today. So it was you? Why did you follow me here? Did you ever figure out how Mama found out you got married out here? A little strange how someone you never talked to suddenly finds out you've been married. It's because I had to be the one to tell her that, Kenneth. Uh, jeez. Which begs the question, how did you find out? A week after you left, I decided to go ahead and check up, check on up you. Or uh, check up on you. So I took a ferry and made my way to Gearin City. Came all that way to find out what my little brother was accomplishing in the big city. Imagine my surprise when I found out that my little brother's been fired and he hasn't been in the si that city for weeks. I was hysterical when I found out you ran away a second time. Well, he didn't... Well, I'm not entirely sure. Well, he didn't... Technically, he didn't run away. He just came here to a better place because, you know, the whole city was a piece of shit. Especially the people living there. That's double what Dad did, you know. Answer the question, Deegan. How did you know I got married? My girlfriend went to... Uh, yeah. My gir girlfriend went to your wedding. Your girlfriend went to my wedding? But there was your Tesla's boyfriend. Yeah. Maybe. I don't know anymore. I got a daughter with her, though. A beauty. Hey, you got a kid, too. Nora was her name. But she's a cutie. It would really, really suck if something bad... Oh, hell no. Don't you fucking dare, Deegan. You may be family, but I won't hesitate to cut you down. Likewise, little brother. I'm gonna be very clear here. If I ever see you again after this, things won't be pretty. That's fine with me. Now get the hell out of my village. Piece of shit. I don't know, Amber. Do you, Amber was really adamant about trying to find her dad at the end of um, chapter 15 with the whole Nightmare Realm thing. I don't know. It doesn't really... Does she... I don't know. Does she really want to go try and find him with how much of a dick he is? And something could happen at the end of this that changes his personality, I don't know. Because I did hear something about Kenneth and Deegan making up, but... Deegan's all fucked up or something. And it's like a robot eye or some shit now. I don't know. I played all of, I played all of Rejuvenation, or all of what's available now, so... I kind of already know some stuff that's going on, which should be obvious at this point. 
I don't even know I'm repeating this. I'm just saying shit now. Anyways, um, Kenneth, who was that? It was Deegan. He followed me here. Deegan? That's surprising. <coughs> anyway, I've located Talia's aura. Really, where is she? Oddly enough, it seems she's somewhere in Amethyst Tunnels. Didn't Amethyst Tunnels have some cave in? Yes, it's possible she's stuck and unable to leave. Let's go. We can't just leave her there. Agreed. Let us make our make our let us make way there at once. Don't forget to grab the capsule key. Amethyst Dungeon. Oh, jeez. Uh, that was a really long fall. Thank you so much for saving me back there, Glade. If I had hit the ground without you intervening, I don't know if I would have survived. Probably not. I don't know how long we've been down here, but we can't just wait around for someone to save us. It's how people die, and also I'll get bored. Okay, so what if Kenneth would be mad at me? I'm my own person, too. If he gets mad, then I'll just have to live with it. Besides, he's not that kind of guy anyway. No. Yeah, so far, it seems the only thing he really has beef with is people that try to fuck with his village and Deegan. So, yeah. I'm not sure what I walked up on. Hmm. Oh, there's a Pokeball I need to get. I think that's Claydol. Kenneth, I sense Vivian's aura below the ground here. You mean she could have fall? Yes, it's possible, but she has to be alive for me to sense her aura. Not sure about her condition, but she is still breathing. We should hurry in case she's gravely injured. Let's make our way down immediately, of course. Hey, can I swap to you too so I can play play with better Pokemon? Halt. Uh, is it the redhead bitch? Who said that? Oh, it's Vivian. To the challenger who presented themselves to my chamber, I welcome you. Congratulations on finding the chamber of reimagining. To proceed, you must pass my test. This is the only way I shall acknowledge you. Oh yeah, because her fuck the temple where Vivian was uh, raised in was uh, down in uh, Amethyst Caves too, wasn't it? Or, wait. Yeah, it was, because, well, actually it was a Kyrados Mountain, but they're pretty close to each other, so I guess this works. To proceed, you must pass my test. This is the only way I shall acknowledge you. But before that, I will scan you. I shall not allow a person with ill intent to participate in my test. Well, it's you, so I imagine you're fine. My apologies. It seems as though the challenger is myself. Of course, that being the case, further testing is not required. Welcome back, Vivian. Hmm. I'm not Vivian, but this is convenient, so I'll let it slide. Yeah, and before I go with this, where does the, uh... Where does, uh, this lead to? Oh. Yeah, okay, I guess I really am gonna have to go in here then. Alright, let's, uh, figure out what the fuck I'm supposed to do in here. Probably something... Okay. I feel a very strong energy coming from this cluster of crystals. This feeling, it's... is almost nostalgic in a way. It must mean this place meant something to Vivian. Fortunately, no matter how many people tell me I'm Vivian, I'm not. I'm not connected to this place as much as she was, and that's fine. Uh, how's that tremor? Maybe something triggered when I touched this crystal? Let's go take a look. Uh, might be the other door. Uh, let me see. Is it, uh... Oh, I guess so. Alright. Oh! Hey! Hey! Kenneth, over there, Talia. Kenneth, what are you doing here? Looking for you, of course. You weren't home when I returned from Giran City. And you didn't pick Nora up from school after seminar, so I... What are you talking about? I picked Nora up from school before I went to the tunnels. That's not what happened at, at all, Talia. Are you... <sighs> this is clear, isn't it? Testing shall begin momentarily. Uh... Oh! Oh, there's Andrew. Alright. Oh god, it's this lady again. Wait, you met Andrew before? Are there only two participants? Um, Talia, just what is going on here? I think I think it is clear, because I don't think Kenneth's met Anju before. Yeah. Talia, just what is going on here? I'm just as lost as you, though weirdly enough, the woman before me is actually Vivian. That's a Vivian? Yeah, I think it's... Are there only two participants? Uh, yes, there are only two. Talia, what are you doing? I'm just rolling with the punches, Kenneth. Very well, if there are only two, the test shall be balanced for two. Testing shall commence. Have we been teleported? Seems that way. Are we on a floating piece of land? Yeah, I also think we're trapped. Uh, what's going on? Ah, ah. I don't, I, I don't like that. I don't like that. I, 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 I no, 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 no. There's so many of them. Can we really take on all of them? No, uh, no. Of course we can, Tally. You have my back, right? Always and forever, as long as you have mine. No matter what, we'll get through this together. We'll show them our unstoppable combination. Okay, I understand. I'll fight for you both until the very end. Oh, jeez. Alright, you know what? Fuck it, we'll do this. Let's get it. Okay, they're not that hard. 
Do they have any... I can't check the... Actually, the whole S mechanic doesn't work, so... Here. Oh, God, they have typings, too? Oh, that's... So that's fire, and I think that's dragon. Okay. Or at least I'm just going off the moves that they've been using. Okay. That's ice or water. Either way, I'm attacking it. Okay, I think that was ice. Y yeah, and that's... Yeah, it's definitely seeming like dragon. Okay, yeah, that's ice. And that's dragon. Hopefully there's only six and not twelve. Because otherwise... I don't think we're going to win this. Especially since I'm out of revives. Okay, so, um... I'm going to go ahead and set up some screens, because that honestly seems like the best... When did you get a shiny Incineroar, Kenneth? I don't think this is Kenneth. And why did you use Flare Blitz on the Dragon one? Uh, it knows Free Shock? Why do you know Kiram Black's signature move? And why are you still attacking the Dragon instead of the Ice? That's... I'm gonna pray that's fighting. That or it's ground. Alright, it seems like it's fighting. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely has to be fighting. I never thought I'd see different type Regigigas. That one has to be water. I'm still convinced that this isn't Kenneth. I'm still convinced this is clear that we're fighting alongside. And yeah, that was water. That's most likely grass. Okay, there's the water. Oh, or that's bug, okay. Yeah, then it's also another valid. That's poison or psychic, I think. Regardless, I blaze kicked the bug one. Or is it fairy? Yeah, I know that. Okay. Okay, so it might actually be Kenneth since the. When did we get a revile and a. Center or though. I don't know. I, I still have my suspicions that that's still uh, clear. Yeah. Oh, nice crit. Okay. That one's either poison or psychic. They seem they only use one move. Okay, that one's psychic. Okay, well, that one's psychic, so I'll send in Glade. Jesus! That's not gonna kill. That goes Lapras. That's grass. That's definitely grass. Yeah. Jeez! Okay. Here, you turn. Hopefully that'll kill it. Damn it! Photon Geyser? <laughs> oh, jeez. Ah, oh, and I'm all, all that's left. Oh, please let these be the last two. Please. That, sure. I, I need a... I need a good move to hit a grass type with anyways, and this is better. Um, 
actually. Hmm. Fuck it. Ah, uh, if I could put you to sleep, that would be nice! Okay, good. Okay. This might be all that's left. Especially if it's treated as the same trainer. Okay, there goes Musharna. Oh, and it got its act up together too, now it's going fast? Shit. Uh. Okay. Yeah, bounce. Alright, good. Please don't be another one. Holy shit, that was close. And that was first try too. Is that enough then? How many have we taken down? Uh, probably a fucking lot. Twelve. Twelve golems I've counted. Okay, well there we go. No matter how many we defeat, they just keep coming back. Can this show use Vivian's madness? Absolutely not, Telly. You'll knock us off the edge. What do you suppose we do then? We can't just sit around and wait to be picked off. Galate, that's idiocy. We, I won't allow it. What did Galate say? He suggested that we leave it behind and find safety. Yeah, no. Absolutely not. We're all getting out of this alive. That's correct, even if it means fighting until we can't. We can't and will not give up. Second round then? Second... Oh, well, okay, there we go. That won't be necessary. You've all fought valiantly. I believe that will be enough. Let me bring you somewhere safer. Yeah, please do. Seems we were transported somewhere once again. Yeah, but this place looks closed in. Can't s I can't sense any auras in the or area besides ours. Wherever we are, we're far from home. Welcome and hello. Uh, the voice is different than before. Oh, shit, it's Nightmare- Ugh. It's her bitch ass. Yeah, if, you, if you've seen me, or seen the Reggie quest in general, then, uh, yeah, you can know Nymira is quite the piece of shit. Yeah. My name is Nymira, and welcome to my chamber. No, our chamber. If you may, please proceed forward. Sure, what's the worst that could happen? Tell you really shouldn't say that. Yeah. I know, let's proceed. I don't like this already. Because in one of the visions that, uh, or flashbacks and that Alita showed whenever clear first appeared uh this is gonna tell me that that's basically just clear fucking with us and not the nymera ghost but anyways you've all battled with unwavering determination companionship and love all are qualities that deem you all worthy of my gift uh yeah this is totally clear my gift will be able to change the destiny of each and every person in this world please will participant one place their hand on the crystal before them i'm um, sure Oh, that felt intense. I think this is unlocking the core. Excellent. Well, participant two, place their hand on the crystal before them? Certainly. Please forgive me. This was yet another test. Before I could distribute my gift, I had to make sure that you're benevolent beings myself. I'm happy to say that you two have passed with flying colors. And I've assured that everyone here is benevolent, my power can be re released from this crystal. This room will now reform itself into a place that reflects the love found within your heart. Let it all be released. Yep, it's the core. They were not supposed to do that, most likely. What is this place? I don't know, but it's beautiful. Beautiful indeed. Kenneth and I have never seen a place like this before. This is a place that I like to call Amethyst Grotto. When the secrets of this place... When the secrets of this place are revealed, the destiny of mankind is at your fingertips. Such power is great and breathtaking, but is also to be feared. Uh, this place has been passed down to you, you must protect it. If such a power fell into the hands of evil, it would be catastrophic. Thank you both. Good luck and farewell. If this place is just as important as she said, then we have to... Uh, oh jeez. Tell you what's wrong. It's just, I suddenly remembered something. My lady, what do you remember? This place is a blessing, but it's also a curse. Yeah, you shouldn't have opened it. I'm pretty sure that was clear that made you guys open this place. Kenneth, I think we did something very wrong. You did! What do you mean? That test we went through wasn't meant for us. We unlocked this place prematurely. Because of that, we... Tally, you're not making any sense. You and I have to keep this place hidden from everyone. Only people we trust should be allowed in here. Do you understand? But, my lady, if the power to change destiny comes with a price. The price of five human lives. Five human lives are required to... Let's get out of here. This place isn't making you well. Okay, but first I will conceal this place within Vivian's amulet. Yeah. 
Okay. Talia, can you please tell me what's going on here? Why won't you talk to me, Talia? I can't tell you anything because I don't understand what I saw myself. I regained part of Vivian's memory about Amethyst Grotto. It was created for a certain purpose, but that purpose is foggy to me. All I know is that its project name was Last Ditch Effort. <sighs> yeah, that's not a good thing. Last Ditch Effort? That's correct. Anyway, I don't want to talk about this anymore. That place is confined with to Vivian's amulet. Only those with this amulet will be able to open up a portal there. I want to go home. Okay, let's go home then. Should we leave Nora at Celis for the night? Sure, but what do you mean before? Huh? I'm not following. He told me that I never picked Nora up from school. But that's not true, Kenneth. Grandma and I both picked Nora up from school. That's when this old lady appeared and asked for assistance. She was hurt, so Cell and I let her stay at the inn for free. I don't think that's, um, Kenneth. Still, Tally, there was no old lady. There's no one at the inn. But that can't be. I know what happened. Listen, it's been an extremely long day. It's possible that you're still winded from falling down that hole. Well, talk me. Don't talk down to me. I know what I saw. For the record, I didn't fall into the hole. I was thrown into it. Yeah. Thrown in by who? Like I said, I went into the tunnels to care take care of the Pokemon that attacked that old woman. When I got there, I was found out that the Pokemon was this bee him. Before I could attack it, the a girl with red hair appeared. Yep. Yes, how did you know? What are you keeping from me? What's troubling you? Why won't you talk to me about things, Talia? It just feels like you're hiding things from me. After everything we've been through, whatever happened to no matter what happens, we'll deal with it together. Was that all just a lie? It's just to woo me over or something? No, you're right. I should tell you everything. When you get home, I'll tell you everything. Thank you, Kenneth. I appreciate it. I can't trust anything knowing that Clear's bitch ass is going around still. Okay. Okay, now I can come in here. Hey, dude. Tell you, it's good to see you. How are, th how are things? Hey, Teddy. Things could be worse. I had an extremely long day and I just want to go to bed. Just got it from sleeping all day. Being a night owl is one of the best decisions I've made ever made. Same with me. By the way, Tally, I found this while exploring the newly made tunnels. Hey, there you go. Shuckle? That's a rare Pokemon, Teddy. Yeah, but I found it in one of those abandoned Pokeballs you showed me a really long time ago. I figured Kenneth would like to keep it. It's kind of his thing, you know? Yeah, you're right. Thank you, Teddy. No problem. Alright, and there's one more I gotta grab. There it is. I just gotta go around to... Yep, it's just... It's just around here. It's clean off. Should probably store this for Kenneth when he gets back. Yeah. Hmm. This won't even let you go there. Okay. I feel disaster looming ahead. Kenneth, I'm home. Kenneth? Uh, Sella. Sella, what are you doing here? Where's Nora? Nora's sleeping in a room right now because I'm here because... Shit. Yeah. And this is why we hate Clear. My mother is dead. No one knows who did it. There aren't any... There aren't, there aren't even any... Le what? How? It was a... She got killed by a fucking Uveltal. No, no one knows who did it. The circumstances of her death are extremely sh strange. Although I'm very sad and I'm not surprised at all. You're not surprised by your mother's murder? Tally, I'm going to fulfill my promise to tell you everything. Remember that red envelope that was on the table a few days ago? Yes, I do remember something like that. That letter was an ultimatum. An ultimatum? What, what were the conditions? The conditions were... Well... If I didn't kill you, they would kill everyone close to me. Yeah. What? That's why I had to send out a letter to my mo mother immediately. That's why I went to Giran City myself so that there wouldn't be any delay. The person who wrote the letter said they already took something from me. When I read that, I knew... I knew that either my mother or brother were dead. Considering my brother stalked me on the way home yesterday, it couldn't have been him. I'm sorry, but this is just too much to process right now. This is why I didn't want to tell you about all this. I didn't want you to fall into despair. No, I'm glad you told me. I can be more careful now. At the same time, this can't be allowed to continue. What will we do? First of all, no one's ever going to harm you, Talia. Not you, or Nora, or Sela, or anyone else. I'm going to find this guy and end him myself. How will you find him? Starting this morning, I'm going to go on runs and see if I can find anyone suspicious. Okay, I suppose I'll just continue on as normal. But we'll, what will we do about Tesla's show? It's tomorrow night. Tesla's not going to like it, but we're not going. Yeah, and, um... Something, t something tells me that around Tesla's show is gonna be, um... Uh, the start of that year in fire that's happened, too. Because, uh... 
Amber 6 right now, and I believe in uh, Matthew's book in the lab you find at, uh, what was it, River's End, I believe? Yeah. In uh, River's End, in his laboratory in River's End. Uh, it's, I think the gear in, in there, in his book there, it said that the gear and fire started when Amber was like six years old. Or I think Amber said she was six years old when that happened. It was either in, in Matthew's book or Amber said it at some point. I don't remember. But yeah, it's, um, it's, it's not, nothing, nothing good's going to come out of this. Yeah, Tesla's not going to like it, but we're not going. Guess we're going to have to pull Nora out of that school trip to Wispy Tower, too. Oh, Wispy Tower's up, too. It's unfortunate, but it's what's best for her safety, for our safety. Okay, I'll inform Nora's teacher, then. It was nice of Sella to take Nora to school while we could discuss while we could discuss this. Yeah, it was. I love you, and I will fix this. I have to. I love you, too. Just be careful, okay? I will. See you later, Talia. I guess I should go tell Nora's teacher that she won't be able to go on her trip. They'll both be disappointed, but it's it's for the safety of everyone. Hmm. Yeah. Uh-oh. Uh. Yeah. Hun, I don't think he's coming. We should go back. The show's about to start. Hey, I'm sorry, Tesla. Gosh, he looks so defeated. Uh, this game's hitting me in the field already. And I, especially since I already know what's coming. Oh, God. <sighs> Nora's at school. Kenneth's out doing his runs. Grandma's just relaxing all day drinking tea again. Where does that leave me in all this? Maybe I should take today to treat myself. It's been a while since I've been to Route 2. Maybe I should go visit? Yeah, I think I'll go do that. I don't think that's a good idea, but... Honestly, you should probably stay here. Where it's safe. But, whatever the plot demands of us, I guess. 